Hi friends, today we are going to talk about how we can transport weights <coughs> of a standard transaction code. Okay, custom will follow the same, but you know, I'll show you a standard one. So I have suppose FBL5N. Okay, so what I have to do is here I have FBL5N. I first go to system, I go to sys status. Okay, and then I copy this program. Okay, then I create a new session. Once the session has been created, okay, here and now I will just put SC38 and I'll put it here. Now, here I will just select execute, okay, and here, here I'll go to utilities and I'll go to environment with utilities environment analysis go to display okay here and here I'll go to variant I'll suppose select this one okay and I'll go to variance and uh, wait utilities transport request okay and here you can see the program name is this and uh, the variant name is this whatever it is okay and here it has been transport choose the variant you want to transport i select it and i click continue and here it is it has been transported so this is very useful i'll just follow the path again it was a little uh, rocky okay so here First, I go to programs and I go to display, right? And then I choose a variant. Okay, so probably I choose something like this. I choose the variant. I go to utilities, transport request. Okay, and now I'll just execute. I'll pick up the variant which I want and I just click on continue. And here is the transport. Okay, so this is the way you can do the transport, the variants. Variants are very important. Because in this way, you can, you have tested something in dev, you have tested something in queue, and then you can move the same stuff in production so you don't have to do manual maintenance of the same stuff that you have done. Okay, so that's it. Stay tuned to my SAP channel and happy SAP learning and have a great day.